Hello friends, uh, today I'll show you use Mendeley Reference Manager in order to insert in text citation in the bibliography. So the first thing what we are going to do is uh, we have to search for Mendeley Reference Manager in Google. Google it and you'll find the first uh, option, Mendeley Reference Manager, download now option. Then download now for Windows option, uh, then click on it. It is uh, downloading. So I already downloaded this file before, so I'll use that already downloaded file. I'll cancel the, the latest one and uh, we'll use that one in, and I'll show you how you are going to progress to the next stage. So this downloaded file, right click on it and run as administrator. So next, uh, uh, these two options will come choose install options uh, Anyone who use this computer or only for me. I use the first one then install As it is shown here, there is no shortcut icon still now. So when the installation uh, finished uh, this shortcut icon will appear on your desktop so it is shown that Mendeley reference shortcut I can game then finish. After that, this window will uh, uh, came. This uh, window will appear. This is wave importer. So there are two things we have to do. The first one, wave importer. We have to uh, choose wave importer. Then Google Chrome. Then after that, install the first one. Uh, so Mendeley wave importer option. Uh, then get wave importer for Chrome option and then this window will pop up uh, my uh, win, uh, search engine is Chrome so add to Chrome Chrome extension add option then uh, finally this extension is done so there is another thing we have to consider. Uh, this one is Web Importer already installed. So the second one will be we have to uh, introduce this Web, uh, this uh, Mendeley Reference Manager with uh, our uh, Mendeley site with Microsoft Word. So the next option, Tools, Mendeley site, then this will come. This color will change into bluish color then we'll uh, install it get uh, close this one and now it is changed into blue color so uh, let me close this one and get it now so you have to give your email address here already registered so you have to give your email address right your email address here and sign in And after that, it will send a code to your email address. Go to your email address and copy that code and paste it here. You see here, Microsoft account. Then copy this code. Copy this code, then... Uh, Insert it, paste it here, then sign in. Yes, option I uh, will uh, choose. Then uh, after that, Mendeley site, get it now option. Click on it. Then taking it to Microsoft 365 to complete this process. Uh, option. Then email address. Uh, you can give your email address, but already registered. Mine is already registered. Then I click on it. Then you see open in Word. Mendeley site open in Word. So we are linking this uh, Mendeley Reference Manager web importer with uh, uh, our Word 
document. You see now this pop up, you have to choose accept and continue option. Got it. Get started. Now it requests you again, Xavier, your email address and password. You have to fill it. And password, then sign in. So you see this step one and step two options are come. Uh, okay, now let's close this one and let us see Mendeley site is available even in a blank document. So let us open this one blank document. You see, let's go reference, then you see, Mendeley site is available now, perfectly installed. So what we are going to do, let us uh, see how we are going to insert index citations and also bibliography. Let us take some sample text from this journal and we'll see how we are going to insert index citations and also bibliography. Copy, then uh, let us go here in this blank document, Word, blank document, and uh, let's paste it here. Uh, so let us adjust the layout. Layout uh, columns one. So uh, what you are going to do here is uh, there are two steps, step one and step two. Step one is to go to library and import uh, those references. It can be journal or reference books or any other uh, source of literature. So when you click the first one, it will take us the uh, the first one web importer. Then what we are going to do? We choose add new in order to bring those uh, already saved references. I already saved three, uh, four sample papers, uh, journal articles on my desktop. So we'll uh, use those samples in order to uh, see how we are going to insert references my, from my computer. And then these are the sample papers. We'll use three of these sample papers in order to save time and uh, open it. Choose three of them, open. And then when you open it, it is already, you see this is greenish running. So 100% whenever it is finished, it will show you the stored uh, references. So three of the papers are stored now how we are going to use these uh, uh, papers in order to cite them and list them in the bibliography so this is in the web importer still stored so we'll go to our word document then we'll call these papers so you'll go down here in your document then when you refresh it these three papers will come refresh this add-in. This word and uh, the web importer are linked, so they are linked, so when it refreshes, three papers will come here. You see, all three papers are available now in our uh, uh, file. So the next uh, step is how we are going to uh, use these papers in the index citation. Uh, you'll choose citation setting. Then the first thing, citation style, you have to choose citation style. There are different types of citation styles. IS style, Harvard Reference System, Vancouver, American Psychological Association, and different types. So you can choose 
one of them then reference choose the papers uh, first you have to choose a place where you want to insert the citations choose the paper then three papers two papers one paper any paper then insert insert citation easy uh, based on IA style all three papers are listed here uh, so if you want to change the style you can choose uh, back you have to go back again citation setting and choose another style in order to list your references based on the chosen uh, citation style uh, let us see american psychological association seventh edition update citation so you have to choose that one then what you are going to say update citation so it will change automatically to this american psychological association way of uh, index citation so you see it is automatically changed into american psychological association seven decision station uh, edition citation style so what is the next next how we are going to insert bibliography bibliography so in order to insert bibliography you have to the right dot three dots are there click on it then insert bibliography so it will automatically continue you see it is automatically generate the bibliography so if you want to change this uh, both in text citation and bibliography in some other style again you can uh, choose the style then update citation it will change both in text citation and bibliography to the chosen style like this so you can use this Mendeley uh, reference manager in order to save your time and uh, this is all about uh, how you install Mendeley reference manager and how to use it uh, so if you have any question you can uh, comment your uh, questions thank you very much please subscribe to my channel